When scientists say that humans evolved over millions of years, the one thing they didn't research was Karens. And a scary thought is, what if they're not in their final form? What could be worse than a Karen? Well, we've collected the best specimens and samples for you in this video. Regardless of what you've got going on, you can't blame a health condition as the reason for being a Karen. A Karen is a state of mind, and this woman certainly has it. <laughs> Number. I got you, girl. I got a non-emergency number. I'm calling for this. That what? That I, uh... Yes. I'm so sorry. I got diabetes and my blood sugar's low. Oh, that's a good, ex good excuse, ma'am. Matter of fact, I am calling the 9800 number. We're spilling over that I got diabetes and my blood sugar's low. <laughs> When this Karen demanded her coffee, I don't think she realized it'd be delivered like this. Watch how Sergeant Karen here can't handle not only her drink, but being kicked out of a bar, too. To leave? Because you have to leave. Can you tell me why, sir? No. Why not? You have to leave. Why? I will call the police, and we can have a scene. You know, I didn't serve this country for little bitch boys like you to f*** everything up. Thank you very much. You're a fat, furry little bitch. I'm awesome. And you're running this restaurant to the ground because nobody likes you because you're a little bitch. You have a new good, that's, a good day. That's, that's not right. Oh, yeah. Okay. How does it feel that everybody's chanting you your name day. to insult Biden? I bet that feels you, great, huh? See you later. Let's go, Brandon! You little yeah. You're a fat little bitch. The brain of a goldfish, this racist male Karen tells this black woman that she's an animal. I need to get my child face. You need face. to get yeah, you need out of my face. face. I will break right your jaw and... Dare you. Get the camera out. Get it's the out, camera it's out. out. It's recording. Listen, Thank you. Great. You're recorded. That's great. And this is going to be aired. And so we'll see if you from, have a job tomorrow. That's great. Stay we'll see if you child. have a job tomorrow. Yes, Nobody I will have a job. Child. We'll see. This is going to get aired. That's great. You do not come in a woman's face and threaten to break her jaw. You do yeah. not threaten to break my jaw. Listen, calm, calm. You do not threaten her. to break my jaw. Get out of her face. Do you understand? Because I have my mace. And they can go really, call really police. bad. Call the Let's call the police, police right now because you threatened me on camera. Yes. Yes, you did. Call if, the police. If my child gets hurt. Let's call the police. I am not going to go drive. Let's call the police. What are you, what are you doing? Call them right what now because you you're not going to threaten me. Let's go. Come um, uh, Siri, call my love. Call me. You are not going to threaten me. How dare you? You don't come in my face either. Who do you think you are? Who do you think you I are? Think call Ruth. Call Ruth, the our attorney. My attorney is on the way. Is he joking? He came in my face. Is he joking? What happened? Call Vila. Stop thinking about it. Don't cry, Naya. He, he's over here. Oh, he, he has a nerve to come in my face. Don't cry. Can did, we, you, did you get it all? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> a huge guy who's just standing on my face. Right? I need to call you. You told me you're going to break my jaw. I need to call you. Yeah. We're at the park, and he said something. I'm, 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 I'm getting it. We're at the park. No, we're at the park, and he said something to BJ. So BJ came to us, and I said, he, I come up, and he was like, hey, how's it going? I said, good. He's like, oh, oh, I said, is everything okay? He said, we're going to see. I said, all right, great, we'll see. He comes up to my face, in my face, and threatens to break my jaw. 
Yes. Yes. And we have it all on camera and we're gonna put this on YouTube. We're gonna put this on Facebook. I don't care. We're gonna put this everywhere. Get out of my face. Ma'am. Get out of my face. Animal. What the heck? Animal. Get out of my face. You're the only animal here. Get out of my face. Yeah, Darren. Yeah, I did call the police. Yeah, Karen. Oh, Karen. That's who you are. You are not gonna talk to my nephew like that. I don't care who your nephew is. And I don't care who your son is. I, it I wasn't do even not about care. my son. It was about her I son. Don't, well, she should have came to me. You know not what? you. She's a woman. It's to people woman. like not you. you. No, like not you. You, you okay. came in my face and you threatened to break my jaw. You're a man. I'm a woman. You're not a woman. Oh, and you are you think you're a man? Come you're in a woman's face. Come in your face? Oh, I have my knife. I dare you. I'm waiting. I this Karen was not happy that someone was right behind her when she was going less than the speed limit. If you look closely, she was never recording like she pretended to be. Karen was just on the phone trying to look intimidating. Here we have a racist entitled Karen who just can't get a hint. I doubt anyone will want to date him once this video gets out on the internet. I recommend you just five, two steps away. You got me up against the car right now? Uh, are, you, no, you're, are, are you up against the car? Can you back away from me? I'm sorry. Are you up against the car? Do you see him harassing me right now? I'm sorry. Okay, ah, and no one's, no one's gonna pay attention to you. You're, you're, you cause you're, and you're, you're a stupid, uh, blue Asian haired girl. Okay. Yeah. Hey. Are you okay with me? you. What? I was, I was literally just standing here. you. you. You know, hey, I, I can record you, 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 you. I can record you, too. I can record you. Hey, you see, you, you see how stupid you are? Entitled? Angry? Rude? Yep, Houston, we've got a classic case of a Karen. Sisters! Did you go to school? Do you know what that means? Leave me the hell alone! Leave me alone! Jesus! You ought to listen to yourself sometimes. I was nice about it when I came in and asked for it. I don't want your help. I don't want your help. Get your supervisor. I don't want the manager. I said supervisor. God, girl, do you know how to shut up? Ma'am. No, ma'am. You didn't do this. I don't want your f***ing help! Do you understand? Yes, I do! You won't shut up! You don't have to respect Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. It's completely uncalled for you to keep harassing me. I'm not harassing you. Your part is not going to the rules. Because you're harassing me. Leave me the f alone. You don't have Do you not understand? Call your boss. Call your boss right now. Call your boss. You're not the one I want to talk to. Call your boss. Whose number is this? That's the corporate number. You wanted the corporate number. Yes. Now. You want to write it down? Ma'am, that is the number. Write corporate number on there for that me. That is the corporate Write number. Write the word corporate office for me. Ma'am, that's the corporate number for me. I write it down. You're stupid. You know that? You're very stupid, ma'am. You said it 
very, very stupid. You are very stupid. You are just stupid. Okay. Would you walk away? I pay for my food if you walk away. Ma'am, I'm not gonna walk away because I'm 14 and your transaction's not going through. Because uh, you've been talking to me. Yes, ma'am. Okay, I'll let you be sure about it. Please, leave me alone, sir. Ma'am, she would listen to this. Instead of the teacher did, you wouldn't have any problem. Ma'am, I just asked what was wrong. That's all I asked. Imagine loving wings so much, you're willing to humiliate yourself to an insane level. Well, this Karen does. Look, you better get her out of my face. You better get her out of my face. You better get her out of my face. I heard you it. Look, let me call the goddamn law. Let me call the fucking law, I'll call the goddamn police out here, I'll call the police. Really? No, cause she she went off on me first. She went off on me first. I ain't got time for that. I paid double the money for this thing, and y'all. Then get it. Then no. It's gonna take some time for this employee to recoup after Karen's coupon rant. He's refusing to take the coupon and then being a jerk about he's it. Doing job. He's, doing he's doing his job. Relax. But why is he running away now? Uh, I don't why? Because he, he can't take the truth. No, because you know what? I would have never, I would have never refused to waste coupon, lady. Give him a break. No, give him a break. No, I'm gonna make sure he's gonna go to another circle. No, 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 no. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go to another circle game. But I lost my coupon because I'm waiting for him to do it. Oh, yeah, chill out. This racist male Karen gets a sharp shock to reality when his neighbor gives him a piece of her mind. Maybe I should put those uh, notices back up on my floor. Do you no. ever shut the f up? When ever I shut the f up in front of my door with your racist? I'm sorry. I don't give a f you're racist as f Yeah, that's what I- I'm mean. okay, your f neighbors are Asians. Right, so they have to leave me alone. Shut the f up! You don't get- you Shut the f up! You don't, you don't okay? Your life. Shut the f Doesn't up! You way. are so f irritating. Yeah. Every f day, uh, you are uh, this, uh, Asians that, yeah. I'm black, they're Asians. Right. Shut the f up! I'm tired of your sh in front of my f door. I'm tired of your bullshit every f day in front of my door. Go inside my soul, okay? Goodbye. 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 You are disgusting. You're disgusting. Good. You're disgusting. You're disgusting shut the f up karen's always believed that they deserve special attention and this one is no different she wants staff on a self-checkout come on somebody pick not up walmart. your phone not walmart. That's walmart. We're at walmart. yes customer service over here now i'm waiting on our Get the receipt and I'll get down. My time is worth more than yours. 
Kevin's can be absolutely anywhere, and this next clip shows schools are no exception. But I didn't expect him to go as far as threatening to fight a student? Let me show you. Defend our country. And you are going to sit there on your butt Don't shake your leg. I want you to do something to get up I'll defend my country from the very end. Then go back to where you're from, Mexico or Guatemala, where? You're born here. And you won't stand up for the flag. Karen gets kicked off her flight, but she's not leaving till she says what she has to say first. Okay. Hello. We're going to take you off of the aircraft. Where'd you have to? Where'd you have to? Yep, you're going to have to get off the aircraft, yeah, okay? Yeah, and you're out there, yep. and I compliment you in that way. But she's a representative of the aircraft. They don't want you flying on their plane today, okay? So you're going to have to get After off the aircraft. After they made us wait and wait and wait. Yeah, that's the way it is, but mm -hmm. right now I'm going to need you. And that's fine, and I will respect that. Okay. So I'm going to need you to grab your bag and just and step off the aircraft. And I did not do aircraft. anything, actually. Disrespect. We'll talk about Disres it outside. Disruptive, besides speak my mind. Okay. I know when I live in America, and that's what... Right. About. Calm down. No, you know Listen that. To me. Grab no, your bag. You know that. You know that. Give me another unit on the plane. You your bag and yeah, yeah, you your... won't. Okay, but I yes. need you to get up. No. Okay. You need me to get up? You may need me to get up, but you know what? I feel my need to do as a person, just like Jesus Christ. You need to call No, no. I'm going to do what I need to do. I'm going to say what I need to do. And if you, you're going to do whatever you feel you need okay. to do to me, right? So I'm going to say what I am meant to say. Yeah, yeah. No, to everybody. Stand up, man. Yeah, everybody is you're doing this. You're going to get arrested if you do not I'm stop. I'm already going to get arrested. You're going to get arrested if you don't stand up and get off the I'm aircraft. I'm probably already going to get arrested. Do you want to get arrested? I really Then honestly, stand up and get off the aircraft. That's all you I have really, to do. I really, it's not about that, man. Okay. You can I'm going to ask you one more time, and then I'm going to have to put my but hands on you, okay? For what reason? Because you're not no, listening. Let me ask you that. Right. You, you're going to put... No, no, no. And that's fine. That's fine. Why do you have a right to put your hands on me, though? Okay, let's go, Come on. No, go why do you have a right to put your hands on me? Ma'am, What am I doing that makes you feel like you have a right to put your hands on me? Seriously, tell, tell though, can you tell me that? Tell the can you just help me to understand as a as a human that is alive, why Why do you? Seriously, though. Yep. Get him like, off. seriously. Why? Grab your stuff, Are get you off gonna, the aircraft. Can I touch you? Listen, have I touched you yet? I'm trying to get you off the aircraft. That's right, all we're trying to do. To, to a control situation. If I get off the plane, no. you said you wouldn't arrest me. So you as a cop should have to honor them. This next Karen is the classic stereotype of disrespecting store employees. I'm amazed they were able to stay so patient and calm with her. Where was her? Ma'am, you that's, that's what we have a problem with. Where? I'm trying to help you, but nah, don't, okay. don't do this. Where was her? Don't do this. Nah, no, don't, don't do this. I don't know. That is my point. My point is you, you don't give a shit. This Karen certainly woke up on the wrong side of the bed today. Typically, if you're that annoyed with someone and they are leaving, not following them is the easiest way to avoid them. Don't touch him. Libria, mother. Yeah, do that. Yeah, do I that. Will. Do that. I will. Call the cop. Yeah. I will. Go back to Texas. Please. Oh, really? You Please. Please. What is going on? Hey, there's cars. Yeah, watch out. There's cars. Hey. There's cars. Watch out, bro. You're up. Huh? You're up. Come here. <laughs> Talk shit. Ain't you nobody, nobody talking shit. Nobody's talking shit. Oh, my. Hey, yo. Cut it out, man. Get in your car and go. Get in your car and go. You walk. Uh, go to your car. 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 Baby, baby. Hey, who? Stir the whole baby, baby, baby. It's not starting you! You! Baby. 
Confronting a Karen over their racist remarks never ends well, but that won't stop us. Get her out of here. She's been harassing me since I come in. And I put up with her kind all day. Who is her kind? Who is her kind? She's been putting up with her kind all day. Get her phone out of my face. She's recording me. Now, if I touch her, and she's been, if I beat her up, you already touched me. If I beat her up. Taylor, if I beat this lady up, Taylor, if I hit this lady, Taylor, if I hit this lady, you want to be touched. Taylor, if I hit Okay, so, Taylor, we just going to separate y'all too. We're going to separate y'all too. What's going on? I did it start here. She's at the register, talking on her phone, back in the lineup, and then there's somebody that forgot to put her mines in her mom's cart, so she goes up there, and she's still on the phone. And then she, all of a sudden, she don't have a license ID to show for the body. I need to show you, so she won't worry about that. Okay. Well, that's the lady at the register. You were we rude to her. Going over there, I think. It's okay, honey. Um, so no, it's not okay. Is look, this a friend of yours? No. Are you I, sticking I don't up for her? Him. No. Because she's not white? No. No. Because so I'm tired back to the of putting up with people that I'm more I don't know either one, one of you. I don't know either I one of you guys. Tag, and then she took my groceries out and looked him across the floor. I sure did. You think that's okay? Kick her ass out of the store. Stop this, you guys. Okay, we need to have a this Karen doesn't seem to understand that shops have a right to refuse service, especially if you won't wear a mask. Hi. Hi. How are you? Great. Thank you. What? Yeah. Don't, don't listen to them because they don't know the law and you would be personally, you're personally liable. Okay, so we're at this check stand. What is your name? What is your name? Amber, are you the manager here at Grocery Outlet? Amber, are you the manager? Okay, so, all right, so they, they're closing the check stand, so you're not going to cash me out, right? You're not supposed to because it's mandatory that you have to wear it. It isn't mandatory. It's not a law, and I have the right to commerce uh, under Oregon statute. So I'm giving you $3.75, which covers the two items that I have. I think this Karen needs to go to her ophthalmologist because you can see from space that she is over the line. Alright, yeah, and I'm gonna take pictures of this and I have over the line. I'm sorry, you're not over the line. You're not over the line. You're not over the line. Right? You're not over the line. This isn't over the line. Yeah, see that? It's over the line. No, it's it is over the line. Ma'am, the front of the car is supposed to stop at the line. So instances like this doesn't happen. Excuse me? <laughs> when did I become? It's not law. It's not law. It's common like sense. It's common sense. I would like to see the camera where you were. Yeah? Yeah. You want you want proof that I've been there since 1.30? Well, I've been here since 12. You have not. Yes, I have. Ma'am, you hit my car. No, I did not. Kevin here really thinks that he can tell when someone is disabled and when they're not. And to top it off, you won't believe what he says next. And that's fine, and you got a park right. You got a park right. You, you have a park right. right. You don't know what's going on with me either. That's matter. why I cost you to mind your business. You don't need to be it, in it's that It's not my business. Is it your park? It doesn't matter. Do you pay for it? it? Is, law, is it people? your business? Okay, well, let's, let's get North Augusta out here. Get him out here. We'll just get him out here. Right now. Get him out here. Not a problem. Man. Get him out here. Cause y'all need to learn how to mind y'all business. This mind is not y'all state. This not y'all city. Y'all, it's not your business. You're in my business. Okay, You're in my business. We'll find out what you do. You're in my seven. business. You upset and you got a part. That's the foolishness. He got the right one today. Ernest Friend over here at the Walmart parking lot on the market side. 
And he's upset That's about a parking lot, right ma'am, now, because I'm parked in a parking spot uh, and I have a handicap CMP sticker. He's mad about. And he's very respectable with y'all. He got in my face and called me all out my name. I can't say who the placard belongs to or who. That's fine. If I say it, I want to call her in. Okay. Uh, Sorry, that's been way too many. Thank you, guys. Wacky Walmart weirdo Karen wastes no time wallowing in a racist Walmart freakout. Yep. Yep, call the cops right now. That, that, that's what I'm tired of. You guys think, you, you guys, you like black people. Oh, you guys think you guys are folks so strong. You guys, yeah. You guys think you're so strong and everything. Right, come on, make a move, sir, dude. Come on. Sir, I'm come, on. Time to go. come on. Come on. Time to go, sir. What? Excuse what? me. What? <laughs> it wouldn't surprise me if this male Karen straight up put a racist rant at shop owner on his shopping list. He needs to go back to Iraq. My country. Go back to your country. Get the f out of my country. After this racist Kevin's outburst at this PTA meeting, I don't think his kids are going to be too popular in class. I remember when I went to his bedroom to say goodnight and he was crying because of the abuse that he was enduring in this school system. And why did you stay in Mexico? Oh. You need to leave. That's indicative of what these kids are. Too. That's indicative of what our kids are. Too. Comments like that, and that's no. He's sharing a story right now, and that's indicative of what our kids are experiencing. Oh, this is Right. Okay. That's right. That's right. You're right. You got the floor. I got the floor. Where are you? But no, no. You got the floor. Hey, you interrupted the chat. You interrupted the chat. All right. This Karen truly thought that she was more important than everyone else in the drive-through line. Relax, Karen. You'll get your coffee just like everybody else. What's a hold up? Um, sorry, man. We're like entirely understaffed. Karen's always love to be in other people's business, and this one is no exception. Where does she get off following a kid? Y'all see this show? Yo, this lady right here been following me for the last block and a half for what I don't know. Lady, why you keep following me, yo? You see this? What, what call me for what? Why is you following me? Damn it. All I was doing was jogging around the neighborhood. All I was doing was jogging. You started following me for what? Weirdo? What? Do you live in here? Do I live here? Yeah, yeah I live here. Why are you asking me that question? Where do you live? Who are you? Is you the police, the security? What you around here, yo? No. Niggas don't know your dumb ass. Yo, get from around me, yo. Stop following me. What is you following me for? Is it because I'm black? This that racist shit. Yo, you voted for Trump, didn't you, yo? No, no, no. Listen, don't bring the racist stuff up. I've just never seen anybody like you around here before. What you mean, like me? You know, like your kind. Did y'all hear that? You said my kind. Yeah, people like you don't live in here. Oh. Kevin's believe the rules don't apply to them, and yes, this includes parking laws, but this level of entitlement causes accidents like this to happen. Take a look. I'm here saying you almost hit my car. 
look, the, the corner's right here. You I almost hit my car. Why are you going to cuss at me, sir? I'm because you almost hit my car with my kid, and then now you're lying in my face. I'm not being rude to you. I never hit your car. See I did it. not almost hit your Goodbye. car. Goodbye. You did. And that's what I'll report to Why your are you parked right here anyway? You're not supposed to be parking this this way and all the And that's what I'll traffic. report to your corporation. That's fine. Hopefully you'll get fired. I'm not, the, your car is parked right get here. Back. I have these videos. Get look how far, look at the distance from how, uh, the get distance from your... in your truck. Can you please dis stop disrespecting me? I totally disrespect you. You almost hit me and my kid. I never almost hit your get car. Get back in your truck. That's the matter with y'all people. Take it, up with your Take it up with your Excuse me, please don't tell me what to do. I'm a grown man. Take I'm not up. disrespecting you. I never said nothing Take to you. I'm just taking these videos so no, I have proof. How did I almost hit your car? Because your car you came right around here. the corner going 30 miles an hour. The truck doesn't even do 30 miles Dude, an hour on the right side. you around the corner. That's fine. Get back in your truck. Don't tell me what Take to do. Take it up with your boss. Please. Take it up with your boss. That's the red, that's... That's wrong with you. Excuse me, don't don't tell me what to do. I'm telling you what to do. You can have have, have a good day, sir. Have a good day. Have a good day. I almost hit his car. He is playing. Sorry. Adam, hold us down. You see this. the distance.